another book that has first appearance in it is that Boom Studios. If you're a Power Rangers fan, we get that Draken New Dawn number one that gives us the full range, first full Ranger Slayer is Draken, right? Right. It would be really hard for me to judge whether or not the Ranger Slayer one shot would be that first appearance of this. Now, certainly it happened in Ranger Slayer. It kind of went unsaid. Um, it was sort of a last scene similar to, you know, what you get in Star Wars where you're kind of at that award ceremony and, uh, you know, she's taking the throne. But uh, Draken in the one sh- in the uh, number one issue of the new miniseries where everyone was anticipating a brand new Lord Draken series. But of course, the series takes place in continuity. In continuity, Draken is really down on his luck. Um, and now Kimberly Hart, a.k.a. the Ranger Slayer, has taken over the role in the mantle as Draken. So this miniseries was expected to be one thing. It came out a whole different way. Um, definitely some heat on this one spoiler variant a lot of people were paying attention to the incentives have done extremely well and of course and the simpleman's comics as well as the 616 comics if you like this title because we have a brand new exclusive uh from steve moore's amazing 500 copy undressed virgin uh very and gorgeous cover art um if you're not familiar with steve morris he's an amazing painter uh does a lot of great work with uh the mighty Morphin power rangers and uh, he did this incredible Lord Draken cover for us right here, um, kind of just picking the former Draken uh, up in the clouds. So all kinds of great symbolism there. And this cover is available right now on both Symbolance Comics and the 616 Comics. 